Hello friends. Today I will discuss the Hello plane friends. angle. Today I will discuss the it is solid angle represented with ang theta symbol. Here let me consider a sphere. We know with radius of the lines like this and in the degrees lines. So let me consider lines, a small area line. A like this 360 degrees on the surface of the like this sphere. What is the meaning of this? How we and get the, these angles? Light sources at point P like so this. So to that know the center of the so sphere. So we have to know the definition of this plane. And what is solid angle? Solid plane angle, angle is nothing but, but it is, it the, is the angle, angle subtended by two by lines. the surface at a point. Surface area is called the at the point P plane angle. Is Let called us assume solid angle. There is a circle that is with a radius. Here we or, have the area A, and let us say there are two from lines. From the surface o -B, of that, the other area O A. We can draw the several lines. This O A like is this. equal to O B is equal this to is radius of the circle from here, from here, from this. Let lines. us say the distance between so that whole point A lines and point B will make a angle L. between this line and, and this, this line. AB like is called is a arc. Three dimensional. And the length of angle. that is called the arc length. So that angle is called the solid So coming angle. to the definition of the and angle, how to put it plane angle. in the mathematical form. Is solid, solid angle is represented is the by angle omega 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 by and two is equal lines at a point. Area. So there are two lines. O A that is here. O B A subdivided by an angle the radius of the here. sphere. So the here we are assuming the Radius arc of the length sphere is divided R. by so that is radius square of, of the radius. circle that is R. Suppose so what are the if this units area for this is angle, formed the units the are circle normally radians with R radius degrees. R. Suppose is, if this radius ra this arc area length has L is equal R to the and forms the circle like radius this, R then. What is the solid angle then at point P? We get the angle theta, theta like this. Surface. Arc length divided by radius R means. So when the surface we get area R. itself is a circle. So we get here in the denominator radius area. R. That so is circle we get area. This and this A we get is represented by get pi R square. So the unit then for this solid is angle omega is equal to A divided so by that R is square. And we replace if the arc length is a with the pi r square equal to the and radius of the, the circle r square. Then, then this the angle form this r, r square going at to the cancel point two. Then we get here by pi. the arc is and the units the for the solid angle, angle theta is nothing but so radius. If this this length uh, that is arc this length is varied. So next this arc suppose length is equal to this area a. Two is R. due to the sphere that is two times R. the radius of the circle. Area of this then sphere, the plane angle will become to four or pi r divided square. by radius r. Then is equal solid to angle in place of arc length we replace due to the sphere. Then we get here is given by R. omega is equal to a by r square. Cancel, then we get that is equal to four pi r plane square angle divided by r square. Two radians. So we get suppose after simplification four pi radians. Let us say. Equal to this. Case. Suppose if area is of the formed due to square circumference of the circle. R. This is the circle and circumference yeah. means suppose area is this in the form length. of square. The periphery length is called in the that case. Area the circle. becomes area of the square is nothing but then side we know the side. circumference of R. the circle is that is equal to two pi R into square. R. This R is nothing but so now if we can calculate what is the side of the plane square. angle theta is equal to arc length divided by so then, R. So in so place of angle arc length we replace with due to the pi R square area is given by a by R, R square that is equal R, 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 R square divided in the denominator by R square. we have another we get so this and this one get cancel as the and we get angle. the plane angle K is, is equal to two pi radians. this area so Depending is upon the, the arc length, length, we are going to get the with the length different L plane angles. With B. So let us see. Then the what area of the rectangle relation become between this radius is equal to L in degrees. B. So then we the know solid angle for a circle formed by the rectangle arc length is two pi area. So degrees at are point P is given by omega is equal because here we have started R square. 
this is and the starting point nothing but here and going like this divided by r square coming like this radius. and reaching the zero so position. knowing so this very you can degrees, say what is this is also equal to angle 2 pi due to radius. radius so rectangular surface so that's why we write here 2 pi is please like the video degrees. share the video and subscribe to the channel suppose we divide this by 2 then we have to divide this by 2 all like this then 2 pi by 2 is equal to pi then 360 by 2 is nothing but 180 degrees that is pi radians is equal to 180 degree suppose we divide this pi with 2 then we have to divide this 180 by 2 so that is pi by 2 radians is equal to 90 degrees then what is the how many degrees is equal to the one radian so how to calculate it so that we can write like this relation between radians and degrees is like this radians pi radians is equal to 180 degrees just now we have seen now for one radian how many degrees 180 divided by pi so when when we simplify it then we get 57.2958 degrees please like the video share the video and subscribe to the channel